if you grew up in the 1970s, you would have been enthralled by a movie that showed up on television out of the blue called The Alien Factor. And so uh, that's going to be our subject for this video. So in this particular case, I happen to find a um, this uh, box cover for the, the VHS for this uh, this movie, and then I managed to find a version of this movie. It's sort of a, I don't know, it's sort of like a riff track sort of thing. And I posted it to my archive page. I don't know how long it'll last up there, so go and check it out if you want to. Uh, but this is what um, I've decided to kind of focus in on. Now I'm going to give you my my Alien Factory Factory Alien Factor memories of the 70s. So I remember this thing coming on TV, and at the time I was with some friends, and we were kind of like thinking, oh, we're going to do something tonight. But, you know, this thing came on, and, you know, it was, okay, it's not a masterpiece. <laughs> it's not Star Wars. Um, but you know what? It was fun. And so we were watching it, and, you know, in the 70s, you didn't expect much from television. So, um, yeah, this thing came on, and you could tell right away that like, it felt like somebody had taken their home movie projector, uh, not projector, but um, Super 8 or whatever, and it kind of made like a homemade movie. And so it had that feel to it, but yet it still had a lot of fun built into it. And even back then, at a young age, although I loved like monsters and stuff like that, I also got a kick out of this movie just because it was so odd and weird. And so, you know, of course, now in these days, people make fun of these shows because, you know, they are they are quite laughable, but they're they're bad in a good way, if you, if you know what I mean. And even in the back of this um, video cover, you can tell, like, they're really trying to stretch, you know, looking for something uh, to sell this thing on. Like when you start talking about the titles, <laughs> the titles of a movie, and and associating them, associating them with somebody, somebody's name who might have done something else, you know you're really stretching and reaching for something. But anyhow, so this is, um, despite it saying 1984, that was when the video came out. Back in the day, you could only see this on television, and it was awesome. The Alien Factor. So I'll quickly just flip through some, like I, I prefer you go to my, go to the archive.org site and actually um, look at this yourself, but I just got some screen captures and this kind of gives you a little taste of the quality of the video and uh, like I said, it's sort of a riff track sort of thing that I found and posted to you. To my site, but um, not my site, archive um, But yeah, you know, it's you know it's well worth seeing this show if you haven't seen it. It one of the cool things about it is the person who made it had an idea. They wanted to make this movie. They didn't have a huge budget, but they obviously scraped together some money. Some special effects, some amateur actors, and they made it. And to me that, there's something to be said, well there's a classic, look at that alien. Um, there's, there's something to be said for, for that kind of style of filmmaking. The boldness to be able to, to, to go, oh here's another alien, look at that. Uh, to go out there and just on a, on a shoestring shoot something like this. So. You know, I want you to take a look at it for yourself. Um, just going to be a quick uh, five-minute video today. Don't want to go on and on and on. I, I keep on going a little long. So this is going to be it for, for this video. The video is posted to, on archive.org. Like I say, it's not. it might not be there long. It seems like they, they tend to take my stuff down right away. But, um, you know, if you, you go up there now, you should be able to. To see it. All right, that's going to be it for tonight.
Take it easy.